to the Jerome B. Farm and Homestead. It's uh, getting towards the uh, end of March, I believe today's the 20th, and uh, we need to do an oxalic acid treatment on our hives. So I've got my generator loaded up and my ProVape 110s in here and my uh, fume mask. So let's get down there and get started. Okay, real quick, we'll show you the equipment we've got here. So we have the Pro Vape 110 and wood bleach. I have two ceramic caps, a quarter teaspoon measuring spoon. I have the uh, 3M5303 acid rated cartridge respirator. So let's get the generator fired up and let's get going. Okay, we're about ready to get started. So uh, one thing we're going to do this time, since uh, I haven't done this in a while, is I'm going to run this nail into the hole down below uh, because I've read some comments and seen from folks that uh, when you push your vaporizer into the hole, the bees may have propolis that hole shut and that propolis will get in the end of this. And when you have this lid on there tight and that gets clogged up and that solid goes to gas and expands, it'll blow that lid off right in your face. So that's something you need to watch out for. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna run this nail in there uh, in the hole of each one of these before I put my vaporizer in. So let me show you. So right here's the hole I drilled. It's right above the screen bottom board cover that you put in for the winter to keep uh, help keep it warm in there. Uh, plus, you can see your mites drop onto this board later on after you gas them with the oxalic acid vapor. So I'm gonna. So here's the hole I've drilled before. So I'm just gonna push that in there, make sure it's clear of any obstructions. All right, I think we're ready to go.
how the temperature drops. When the acid goes down in the cup, it cools it off. And when it heats back up to 230, it's ready to go to the next one. See a little bit of vapors coming out there. See the temperature starting to come back up now. drifting off way over here. It's pretty calm right now. There's not hardly a breeze at all. Okay, we're about back up to temperature, so we need to get ready to move to the next one. Okay, for these single deep hives right here, I only put one scoop. Just put half as much. I think I said before this was a quarter teaspoon, it's actually a half.
Okay, I'm gonna end the video here because it's getting dark on me. I've got uh, five, six more to do, so that's probably about another 20 minutes or so. <coughs> Ooh, I can smell that stuff. But uh, anyway, this is how I uh, vaporize my highs with oxalic acid, and uh, it kills the varroa mites. So if you don't know much about varroa mites, be sure and look them up and see what they can do to your hives. Uh, they cause abscons and things like that. And whew, I need to quit breathing this. I got to go. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Whoop.